Okay, so I wanted to go over the way to access drawings on your iPad. So the first thing we're going to do is come into our good reader, which is the green icon with an eye on there. We'll open that up. Okay. So when you come here, you're going to have a list of my documents, and there should be a folder called drawings. Now this folder is synced to your specific project Dropbox, which was set up on an earlier date. So we go ahead and we click on drawings, and you should have a list of all of your drawings here on the left hand side that are in sync with whatever updates have been made. Now the first thing we'll do here is just go into our architectural set of plans, and we're going to go ahead and just click on that, and it opens them up and starts loading them. Now it does take a moment or two sometimes to load these files and render them. Um, now to go through pages, you have a couple of options here. You'll see that when I just click on one of the sides, it'll go previous page. If I click on the other side, it'll go next page. If I click in the middle, it will bring up my menu. Now some of the things there, depending on how your drawings are set up, if you click on the little book symbol here, that will give you the bookmarks. And they're, oh, they're right here. So under outlines, we have a list of every page that the architect has in his set of drawings, which is very handy if you know exactly which page you want to go to. Say if I want to go to page 520, I just scroll down to it. I click on that, and I jump right to that page. Now if I want to zoom in, I simply use the pinch and zoom in command, which is by pushing the fingers outward. I want to zoom back out. I just squeeze my fingers together and that will zoom in all the way out. Okay, I'm going to bring up that menu again. So we also can just click and use this to skip through pages if we know what page number it is we want to go to. On the left hand side there's a scroll wheel here. Okay, we'll hit skip to another page. We can also um, go to a multi-page view where it shows single pages, double pages, or double pages with the cover. I like to leave it on the single page, it makes it easier. Um, if we needed to read it as a text document, if it was a document, we could just click on the text symbol. We don't want to do that here. And that's about it for just the simple flipping through a set of drawings. We can swipe to go from page to page. You'll see that most of these are pretty well easily loaded up. 